For example, if you see a 2021 GT500 carbon fiber track pack for $10,000. I mean, that one obviously should be a huge red flag. Obviously, that's a scam. But some of your smarter scammers are a little bit better at it than that. They'll put up a 93 Cobra for, say, $15,000, which is a deal, not a steal, but it's a deal because it's far less than those cars are going for. Now, there's always a chance that maybe that seller just doesn't know the market and that's what they're putting that car for sale for, so the deal might be there. And a lot of those times, that's what they will lead you into is they'll get you with a price that might be close enough to make you think this is legit. They get you to start messaging them and then that's when things go downhill.